I remember so specifically being 15, maybe 16 years old and just scrolling through YouTube. And this is when my interest in bodybuilding and competing was very first starting to develop. So like, you know, I'm actively searching through YouTube for people that I can relate to, maybe somebody to kind of draw motivation from, um, draw some inspiration from. And like I said, I remember so clearly, I came across one of Christian's videos and it was like, I remember so specifically, I was like, there's something about this dude. I'm very drawn to his content. And um, you know, it was a summer shredding video or I'm not sure if the, the actual series was coined that name yet, but um, you know, he was prepping for a show. And I knew that I wanted to do something along the lines of bodybuilding. It actually wouldn't be until about three years later that I was prepping for my first show. But um, point is, you know, just from being a teenager, 15 years old, uh, I was kind of hooked. Um, so, you know, from the age of 15 up until now, you know, 22, I've been following this man for seven years. I've watched Alpha Elite be basically born and developed and turned into what it is today. So, as you guys can imagine, that just makes the fact that I am, you know, working with Alpha Elite that much more insane to me. Um, I actually have photos from, it had to have been the one of the first few Alpha Elite drops. It was in 2015 and, you know, I had my mom take the pictures out in front of the crib and shit, but uh, it's just so crazy to go from being the kid that was inspired and never even had the thought cross his mind, okay, I would be associated with this company one day. I would have the opportunity to work with this company one day to growing into the industry, growing into um, the bodybuilder, the athlete, for the brand that I've been building myself into over the last few years, it's really wild that I found myself in the position to work with this company. You know, it was after my second time competing at Summer Striding that I was like, I will earn an Alpha Elite sponsorship. Uh, I said it on camera multiple times, like I will earn an Alpha Elite sponsorship. And originally I thought that was gonna be through winning Summer Shredding. I went into this most recent prep saying and wholeheartedly believing that I was going to win Summer Shredding and earn that Alpha Elite sponsorship. Um, you know, that didn't happen. You can't control who shows up you can only control the effort, the um, heart and passion that you put into your individual prep. You know, to make a long story short, I did not end up taking that title, taking that win. But what I did end up with was a DM from Christian. It was probably 9 a.m. We were in a Chicago hotel room, just chilling, getting ready to start our drive back to Indy. And you know, I'm just sitting on my phone chilling while Mariah's getting ready, and I see that Christian Guzman followed me. A little blue check mark next to his name and all. I had to click on the profile to make sure I was like, oh, this is probably just some you know weird random hacker account, whatever. I have to record this. It's Sunday. The show is on Friday. We are sitting in a Chicago airport room. I just post a Q&A on my Instagram, so I'm on my, on my Instagram, nothing new, just scrolling through answering questions. I refresh my feed. It says Christian Guzman just followed you a minute ago. I, I I did a little scream, a little shriek, a little... You said, oh my God. I said, oh my God. What the fuck? You know, I'm thinking, damn, like, damn, like, that's insane. Like, I didn't know what was about to happen next. Went in there, showed Mariah. And then I go to my DMs. It said, you killed it this weekend, man. I'm going to instruct my athlete manager, Dylan, to reach out to you later this week if you're interested. If you're interested. If you're interested. 
I've been watching this man and this brand grow since I was 14 years old, if I'm interested. Like me and Mariah just for like probably like two minutes straight just like you had an email left and now I don't even know like it, you know the like when you get some news that like you can't even like fully wrap your head around it's just like <sighs> wild man wild I was like, this is probably just some weird, random, fake account. And so I clicked on the profile, and I was like, Christian Guzman just followed me. The dude that is, plays a large role in why I have the goals and ambitions and the positioning that I'm in today just followed me. Crazy concept. So, you know, I'm, I'm kind of, you know, ah, oh, Mariah, come look at this. I go over to Mariah, I'm showing her. And I see I have a DM request. <laughs> Bro, it's still so crazy. It's still so crazy. When I tell you guys, I was hysterically, I don't even know if that's the right word, hysterically laughing, hysterically just like, I lost my damn mind. Like when I seen that shit, it was just like, it was a moment of just really taking in and being present with, okay, your effort fucking pays off. Your passion, your tenacity, your, your grit, your refusal to give up when shit is hard pays off. Manifestation comes to fruition. Like, I talked about that shit. You can ask all my friends, everybody that's close to me. I talked about, I will earn an Alpha Lee sponsorship. All through, from, from the second show to the third show, my second, time complete, my second time competing in summer shredding to the third time, I talked about I will have that sponsorship one day. And to just visibly see that I had created that for myself was, I mean, it was probably all the motivation that I, I will ever need or need for a long time. To, you know, just keep pushing forward especially when shit just seems like it's not going nowhere or shit just seems like am I in over my head. For anybody that's prepped, you guys know the, the mind games definitely start to roll in once you dwindle down to those last few weeks. So, you know, if nothing else, just kind of extract from this video that when shit feels like it's not going, keep pushing, keep manifesting, Keep doing the shit you know you need to do to get where you want to be, because I promise you, it'll pay off. I promise you. And it might not be in the way you think it will. You might, it might not be in the amount of time or the time frame that you think it will. But inevitably, when you apply enough pressure, you apply enough time, you apply enough effort into something that you truly want, you'll make it happen.